friends welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching in this video I'm gonna show you how to get super glowy dewy healthy looking skin even in the cold winter months when it starts to get really cold outside my skin just gets so dry and dull and it sucks so I use a few really great products to rejuvenate my skin and skincare is always number one but um, I use some really great products to rejuvenate my skin and make it look like I have a healthy glow even in the winter when the sun just de decides to disappear for months. So if you want to see my glowy foundation routine then keep on watching. So in the winter months when your skin starts to get super dry, just make sure you're really taking care of it and you're really focusing on your skincare to give your face the best possible base before you put your makeup on. If your skin is in the best possible shape, then you really can have beautiful, healthy looking skin, even in the winter time when it gets a little bit harder to um, have that glow than in the summer. So I like to start by just using a primer. Um, I love the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. This stuff is so good. It's oil free, but it is like a silicone based primer and I love it because it just smooths out my skin. I'm just taking a little bit. It just smooths out your skin um, without making it dry whatsoever. So I will put this, I like to focus it in my T-zone, but pretty much put it all over my face. Okay, so after I rub that in, um, I'm going to be using this Smashbox Camera Ready BB Water Foundation. Let me just say, this is so slept on in like the beauty community because I never hear anything about this and it is so good for dry skin. If you have dry skin, you need this. It is so um, like liquidy, you do want to shake it up, but it has like decent coverage and it um, you can really build it up. I really really love it. So what I like to do is just put a little bit Get my hair out of the way on the back of my hand And you can tell like it's liquidy you guys So I'm gonna use this tart brush and I just bought this last week and I don't even know what I Was doing before this I never could get myself to buy it for years because it is expensive But oh my gosh so worth it Christmas is coming up ask for this brush it's amazing okay this is like dripping all the way off my hand it's so liquidy so I just put a little bit on my brush and I just buff it out over my skin so it's like a water based um product so it's not going to dry you out if anything it's going to hydrate your skin so you can continue to build this up however much coverage you'd like um I just like a thin layer when I want my skin to look like my skin and I want it to just look healthy and glowy and dewy, I just put a thin layer on. So once I blend that out, I'm going to conceal. I'm gonna use this uh, Smooth Liquid Camo Medium Coverage Concealer by Dermablend. Mine's in the shade Nutmeg. down the high points of my face then anything I need to cover up and I'm gonna blend that out with a beauty blender a damp beauty blender I strongly recommend um, if you have dry skin to use a beauty blender it um, will not cling to any dry patches um, if you have dry skin or you have those dry patches because I've had that so many times um, Always use a beauty blender to blend it out. It'll just work a lot better than a brush. Okay, so now my skin is just evened out. It just has a healthy glow because of the BB Water Foundation. My concealing is done. And now I do wanna set my under eyes and you wanna use a hydrating powder. I'm gonna use the Laura Mercier Loose um, Setting Powder. I love this, it's a staple in my makeup collection. And another thing I would recommend is when you're setting your under eye area um, and you still want to look, you don't want to look too powdered down, you want to look glowy, um, set it with a beauty blender. Take a little bit on your beauty blender and set right under your eye. Don't set anywhere um, like the high points of your face because you want that to be 
dewy and natural looking. You don't wanna powder everything down. Don't powder down your whole face. Just go right under your eyes where you need to so that way you don't crease. If you don't crease, then you don't even need to do this, but I always do. So I look up and I just powder down right under my eyes. And then I also do wherever I get um, oily. So like down the um, sides of my nose, my chin, in the center of my forehead. I'm pressing this in with a beauty blender. There's just something about it that like melts it into your skin and doesn't make it look cakey whatsoever. You wanna make sure you're not powdering your cheeks because now I'm gonna do, um, I'm gonna put on some liquid highlight. Just so pretty, especially in the winter time. It just looks very naturally dewy and hydrated. I'm gonna use the Sephora Radiant Luminizing Drops. These are so pretty. So what I do is I take a little bit, it's like a little, it comes in a little dropper, and I put it on the back of my hand. It's running low. Just put a little bit on the back of my hand. And then I take the bottom of my beauty, I use my beauty blender for everything. Take the bottom of my beauty blender and put it on the, the end and I just put it on the high points of my face. And yeah, you can just build it up to whatever glow you would like. Now to go a step further, I'm also going to use by Sephora. I just got this and it is so amazing, you guys. It's the Perfection Mist Nude Glow and it's like a spray bottle for your face. So shake it up and then I also apply this to my beauty blender. I just spray it because I have more control. You can just spray it on your face, but I like to have more control. And this just makes your skin look wet. Also, if you are gonna do like a powdered highlight, I strongly recommend um, spraying this over it because it won't look like you just have a streak of powder down your face. It'll melt the powder into your skin and give it such a pretty glow. Okay, now that we are all glowed up, highlighted, I am going to bronze up my face. This Sweetheart Bronzer, Baked Luminous Glow Bronzer in Sweet Tea by Too Faced is so beautiful for just um like glowing up your skin and bronzing up your skin it is cool tone so you can um contour with this if you'd like but i just like to use a big fluffy brush and just put it all over um my face and it just gives you such a natural bronzy glow After my bronzer, I'm just gonna spray my face with the Mario Badescu facial spray that I'm obsessed with. Ooh, girl. Okay, and now you have dewy, healthy, beautiful looking skin, even in the winter time. I'm gonna finish up the rest of my face really quick. I'll be right back. All right, so I just finished off the rest of my makeup. It is super duper glowy up in here. We are all going to be glowing this holiday season. I hope that you guys like this video, and if you have any video recommendations that you would like to see, please leave me a comment, and do not forget to subscribe before you leave, and I will see you soon. Bye.